Hello friends, I welcome you to my YouTube channel MacPM. So in this video, we will solve a numerical problem which is based on the velocity potential function and if stream function. So let's read the problem. In a two-dimensional incompressible flow, incompressible flow means del rho by del t is equal to zero. The fluid velocity components are given by u is equal to x minus 4y. So u x minus 4y and v is equal to minus y minus 4x so that velocity potential exists and determine its form find also the stream function so we have to do three things we have to show the velocity potential exists we have to find velocity potential function and we have to find a stream function okay <coughs> so when will velocity potential exist if this flow will satisfy the continuity equation so what is the continuity equation for steady in incompressible flow it will be equal like del u upon del x plus del v upon del y plus del w upon so del v upon del y plus del w upon del z is equal to zero but this is two dimensional flow only u and v are given so it will become like del u upon del x plus del v upon del y is equal to zero so if you find del u by del x then it will become del by del x x minus 4y we are partially differentiating with respect to x so y will become constant here so it will become 1 similarly del v upon del y is equal to del upon del y minus y minus 4x so we are partially dif differentiating with respect to y so x will become constant so it will become minus 1 now del u upon del x plus del v upon del y is equal to 1 minus 1 is equal to 0 so it is satisfying uh, continuity equation so we can say that velocity potential function will exist now one more thing what is the uh, definition of velocity potential function velocity potential function is given like if negative derivation in any direction suppose in x direction will give velocity in that direction so del phi by del x minus is equal to u similarly minus del phi upon del y is equal to velocity in y direction which is v okay so u and v are known to us x minus 4 y and minus 4 minus minus y minus 4 x so from here minus del phi upon del x is equal to u so u is x minus 4y from here minus del phi or del phi is equal to minus so we can write it as 4y minus x because this minus will go this side into del x so if you integrate both sides then you will get phi is equal to 4xy minus x square by 2 plus constant so we are integrating with respect to x so y can be also constant so we can write it as function of y okay similarly to find fy we will go this side so from here this is equal to v is equal to minus y minus 4x so this minus will be cancelled so del phi upon del y is equal to y plus 4x so from here del phi is equal to y plus 4x into del x if we integrate sorry del y if we integrate both sides then get phi is equal to we are integrating with respect to y so x will be constant y square by 2 plus 4xy plus y is variable here so x can be constant so constant will be function of x so these two things are equal okay because both two, these two are velocity potential function so we can equate these two y square by 2 plus 4xy plus fx so from here f you see f4xy will be cancelled so it will become minus x square by 2 plus fy 
is equal to y square by 2 plus fx so from here if you you can compare these two then you can see that it is only possible if fx is equal to minus x square by 2 and fy will be equal to y square by 2 so let's put this value fx is equal to minus x square by 2 here so we'll get phi is equal to 4xy minus x square by 2 plus fy is y square by 2 so this is velocity potential function okay now we have to find the stream function so what is the stream function if you remember the definition from our pre previous videos then you will know that a stream function is function whose derivation along any direction suppose in x direction gives velocity perpendicular to that direction so it will become v in y direction per perpendicular to x is y direction so velocity in y direction is v similarly del psi upon del y is equal to u but you remember that it is minus here okay so if you put the values here del psi upon del x is equal to v now what is the value of v v is minus y minus 4x minus y minus 4x and here del psi upon del y is equal to minus u so u is if you see here x minus 4y so if you move this opposite side then it will become del psi is equal to minus y minus 4x into del x we can integrate both sides similarly here also del psi is equal to this can be 4y minus x into del y we can integrate both sides here also so from here you will get with respect to x if you integrate then y can be constant so minus y into x minus 4 into x square by 2 plus function of it can be integration of constant but here y is also constant so it can be function of y okay and here psi is equal to 4 y square by 2 minus x y plus function of x because x is constant here so it it is minus x y minus 2 x square plus f y and here it, it is also psi so these two will be equal 2y square minus xy plus fx so minus xy minus xy will be cancelled so we can see that minus 2x square plus fy is equal to 2y square plus fx so it is only possible if fy is equal to 2y square and fx is equal to minus 2x square so if you put the values here see psi was this psi was minus xy minus 2x square plus fy plus fy is 2y square so this is the value of stream function ok you can also put the value here in this side and also get the same value ok so i hope you understood how to find the stream function and uh, uh, velocity potential function from velocity components if you have any doubt then you can ask in the comment section and if you like this video then please share and subscribe to our channel thank you for watching